blockbuster night on Dancing with the Stars, famous dances night, and we had some great ones. Ginger and Val dancing to Janet Jackson, Vaughn and Whitney to Michael Jackson. Jesse's here breaking down the ladies from the ballroom. Hey, Jesse. Hey, George. That's right. It was such a blast in the ballroom last night. The pros and stars going all out with their famous dances. But at the end of the night, it was Wanye and Lindsay who were totally in sync and dancing off with the top scores. Bye, 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 boys to men. Bye, bye, bye. Wanye and Lindsay were right in sync in the ballroom. Bringing down the house to the mega hit in front of NSYNC's Joey Fatone and Lance Bass, drawing rave reviews from them and the judges. I've never seen you be so in it. You were in it, under it, around it, and then you kicked it to the curb. <laughs> Earning the new couple to beat a 29 out of 30 and an emotional moment backstage from Fatone. It was like a dream come true. Watching, watching one of the guys from Boys to Men perform one of our songs. Honestly, we, we looked up to them. Could not be more proud of you, my man. <laughs> from Bye 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 to getting footloose, Antonio and Sharna set the ballroom ablaze with a jive that had everyone on their feet. It's as much about the will to win as the skill to win. Jody Sweeten, the comeback kid of the night after a scary injury in rehearsal. I'm not gonna let anything stop me. Soaring back into the ballroom with a powerful performance to try by Pink. You gave it a wonderful interpretation. You pulled it off and I have to give you credit for that. Give me a beat. Ginger and Val mixing it up with a Janet Jackson vibe. Talking to our cameras right after the show. This is a very tough season. I see so many more front runners this season than I've ever seen in any other seasons. But one couple had to leave. Doug and Karina ultimately the ones to go. The night ending with big chance and an emotional moment. Just an amazing experience getting to know Karina dancing. The whole group as a family, we've all been together. Thank you guys so much. I mean, it's been an unbelievable experience. So proud, amazing season. Had an opportunity to not only just meet you, but to make a great friend. So thank you so much. Uh, from Footloose to Hairspray, so many amazing renditions of our favorite performances in the ballroom last night. But I want you to look at this. Nile and Peta's costume game was so on point, the duo really channeling their inner Jim Carrey and Cameron Diaz to recreate the mask. Can somebody say, Smokin? Oh, wow. <laughs> I guess you can. Yes. <laughs> Apparently, yes. Jesse. Thanks, Jesse. <laughs> and now, uh, Doug Flutie, Karina Smirnoff here right now. Thank you guys for coming in, flying all night long. Yeah. So, Doug, you're hearing those cheers last night. You must have felt like you were back on the football field. Uh, it, it was fun. I t we got that out just about every week, and it was just yeah. so heartwarming, and it, it puts me at ease and makes you a little more relaxed. I know I'm a nervous wreck going out there, but it was really nice. It, the crowd was always behind. Oh. Yes. The last two weeks have been pretty good. It got better. But yes. week one, tell them week oh one. Oh, my gosh, week one. So, you know, you stand in there, and you hear the beep, beep, beep. So I look over, and I see Doug doing this. And I'm like, oh no, oh no, stay with me. <laughs> I can imagine. And what was it like learning Bollywood? Because I'm sure that's out of your comfort zone. It's all out of my comfort zone. <laughs> so the, the, the fun thing about Bollywood, it was even new to Karina. Yes. So she she that's started doing the research and the homework right away. So yeah. But it was it was actually fun and maybe in our wheelhouse or my wheelhouse a little bit because it was more movement. I don't know, it, it just seemed like something you could pick up or learn. I'd... Yeah, it looked good, you guys. No, and I think also because six weeks of dancing live on the show and then three weeks of rehearsal, it all kind of came up to the last week. So when you started doing Bollywood, besides the fact that every move means something, it's one of the coolest styles. Like, I'm in love with Bollywood. That's I'm gonna fine. go take it up. <laughs> but he just like dove in and started like doing it naturally and with the whole trip, you did fantastic. You are one incredible Indian. <laughs> That's all there I, it is. All I ever wanted to be. And you got your football fans behind you, Bill Belichick. Shout out on Instagram, Tom it, it Brady. It was really cool as well. when Tom and Bill jumped on board and gave us a shout because Bill doesn't do that stuff. Mm, you know? no. Tom occasionally might make an appearance, but not too often. And then Bill never. So it was nice. Yeah, I had a chance to play with Tom and Bill coached for a while or play under him. So. They just showing their support. Yeah, it's terrific. And hey, we, I, I, nobody will forget your incredible tribute 
uh, to your mom and dad. Um, no, she was a fan of Dancing with the Stars. Yeah. What do you think she would have said oh, about man. your dancing? First, just the fact that I would be on the dance floor anywhere, she would get very excited. <laughs> my mom loved that. I mean, my love, my mom loved dancing herself, and, and at weddings, whatever it was, and it would have to try to drag me out on the dance floor with her. At times, so she would have absolutely have loved so this she's whole looking experience. Down with a big old smile. No doubt about it. And now it. you're going to be dragging people out on the dance floor. Uh, <laughs> I, I, you know, I'll be much more comfortable about it. That's something I, I said. Her job was to make me comfortable being uncomfortable, and she did it. She pulled me out of my well shell said. a little bit, and I'm. I'm Mission accomplished. <laughs> yeah, you guys are a great couple. Thanks for coming in today. Thank and you. of course, the double elimination is Monday night, eight seven central, right here on ABC.